my father introduced me to cycling. He was a cyclist always when he was younger. And then I was born and he stopped riding so much. And then when I was a, a toddler, I would always see him reading, leaving for rides. I would always want to ride with him. So that's, that's kind of how I got into it. And then, yeah, I started racing mountain bikes when I was maybe nine or 10. And then I got my first road bike when I was 12, I believe. And then just started racing locally. And then as I got older, nationally in America and then came to Europe when I was 16 years old and then from there was coming over every year until I was a professional and then raced a few years as a U23 in the pros and then signed with Team UAE in 2020. The 2020 Giro was a really good experience for me especially with it being such a, a crazy year it was nice to have not only my first Grand Tour, but quite a successful one. Um, the GC result was decent, 15th, but I was also able to have some good results on multiple stages, so it was overall a really good experience for me, and I learned a lot. I was originally supposed to race Giro, and then uh, the season was going so well, uh, at Basque especially, that the team decided give the tour a shot not only to help today but also you know go for some results for myself so I think it was a it was a big step up and showed that the team had a lot of trust in me so it was, uh, it was a really good good for both of me and myself and the team I think I think it's a huge huge deal to come into the my first Tour de France uh, riding for the defending champion but there's definitely some you know, a little bit of pressure, but I think, yeah, not, nothing horrible, just, you know, we all know, we all know, and we all know our jobs, so we go into it like, like any race, so we just give it our all for, for today. Yeah, my personal goals are to just do as much as I can for the team, and then, for sure, the two time trials, I think, will really suit me being a bit longer, and, uh, yeah, so I hope to go well there, and then, you never know what kind of opportunities will come up for, for stages and whatnot, so we'll kind of have to see how the, how the race plays out. But for me, uh, definitely helping with the GC is first and then some good time trial rides, hopefully. My strengths as a rider, I definitely would say my strongest is the time trial and then also can climb quite well. So okay, I always ride for, for the general classification and that's kind of where I hope to develop and uh, really continue improving my climbing abilities and yeah, that's as a GC rider and hopefully a Grand Tour rider in the future. Since uh, stepping up to the World Tour with UAE team Emirates, I've definitely, I think, improved all around as a cyclist. There's not one specific area that's improved. It's just you get older, stronger, smarter, and the training's better. So yeah, all around just overall improvement, but I think over the next years, I can definitely make some more uh, improvements in my climbing and then that'll help out with the GC results as well. So that's how I hope to continue. If I could borrow one skill from one of my teammates, I would probably take uh, Fernando's sprint and then, then I could pretty much do anything, climb, time trial, sprint. So I think I could win some more races that way.